Hey everyone, my name is Melissa Goad. I am the director of They Don't Cast Shadows. My name is Bob Leone. I'm the author of They Don't Cast Shadows and the producer. Hi, my name is Alex Long. I'm a director and photographer. Hi, my name is Michael Duong. I am the gaffer for the film They Don't Cast Shadows. Hello, I'm Wendy Dispinette. I was in charge of makeup and special effects. I'm Craig Vincent. I'm the production sound mixer. I'm Rafael Malari. I'm the editor of They Don't Cast Shadows. Fill her up, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Hey. <laughs> Lisa, I'm like so proud. Thank you. Your life will never be the same. I'm so excited for you. God will bless you. Just watch. I'm oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to startle you. I just wanted to give you your first Bible. Wow. Thank you. I like the connection they seem to have, you know? Me too. They have yeah, good connection. Good chemistry. Yeah, good chemistry. I'm just happy to, to be able to get the shot that um, Melissa wanted, the overhead. Yeah. Yeah, you had to take down, we, this uh, had to location. do a pre-rig and then break that pre-rig down and kind of like rebuild it in there and then <laughs> test that again. It was, a, it was a really good opening shot for the trailer. Mm -hmm. So I'm glad that we caught that shot. How far up was that, Mike? Twelve feet. When I measured it, it was roughly eleven to twelve feet. Um, yeah, where the point, where the sensor is from the ground. I was watching you guys build that, and it looked like, you know, a trapeze or something. So it was. Yeah, yeah that was a. Uh... It was like a DIY go post. <laughs> yeah. Originally, in the in the the facility or the the room that we were shooting in, um, there was all these really pretty hanging lights, and it was just. Um, like the outdoor lights that, that people have hanging in their backyards and stuff. So this, this location had that and I really loved the way it looked and I loved the, the lighting from it and stuff. So Mike, they, Mike and Alex actually, and I probably the, the PAs, um, took apart that whole fixture and pushed it all back. And I was like, what are you guys doing? Like, oh <laughs> and, um, but they did a beautiful job of recreating the light of that look and, um, it definitely wasn't the easiest thing to have to do. And so I was really impressed with the way they did it. And there was just that, that shot, like I just saw that shot so clearly in my mind of it, of them coming down on top of the actors and uh, in the in that first spot. So I'm glad that they were able to get that. Yeah, shout out to the uh, lady at the front desk. I think she, she was able to help us. Yeah, Britt, she was able, she was a very big help in terms of how to navigate that room and making sure we didn't quote unquote mess it up, you know? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Sound was easy. They, they cleared all that space for me. All I had to do was hang a boom right overhead. It was a piece of cake. She was kind of in the way. <laughs> I used to have it. Yeah. <laughs> JK, LOL. Well, I think everyone did a great job. I let, our actors did an amazing job, too. I was really impressed with them. Um, and even, you know, we, we shot for three days in total. And the majority of the cast was on day two, which was this was a scene and just the chemistry that the whole cast had just working together just for that short period of time i was just really impressed by that yeah, the, yeah they the, did a really good job of choosing those people yeah <laughs> man they were on it they were good yeah casting was fun all right thank you everybody for hanging out with us as we talk about scene three and we will see you guys later <laughs>